Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling an important question that many Android developers are asking. Is Async Task deprecated now with Async Task Loader? Our viewer wonders if Async Task Loader, which offers built-in best practices like thread duplication and premature death prevention, makes Async Task obsolete. Should we still consider using Async Task or is it time to fully embrace Async Task Loader in our projects? Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully getting you to that solution. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and get through to that resolution. Now, let's get started. Let's start by understanding the role of async task in Android development. Async task is designed to perform background operations and publish results on the UI thread without having to manipulate threads and handlers directly. However, async task has some limitations. It can lead to memory leaks if not handled properly, and it is tied to the life cycle of the activity or fragment, which can cause issues during configuration changes. Now, let's introduce async task loader. Async task loader is a part of the loader framework and is designed to handle asynchronous loading of data in a way that is life cycle aware. This means it can survive configuration changes. Given these advantages, you might wonder if you should stop using async task altogether. While async task is not officially deprecated, it is generally recommended to use async task loader for tasks that require data loading, especially when dealing with configuration changes. In conclusion, while async task can still be used for simple tasks, async task loader provides better practices for handling background operations in a robust way. It's advisable to adopt async task loader for new projects. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. Async task was not deprecated in 2017, but it is now deprecated in Android 11 due to memory leak concerns. The recommendation is to use Java's concurrency utilities or Kotlin's coroutine libraries instead. The official commit in the Android AOSP project includes a deprecation notice for async task, urging developers to switch to more modern concurrency tools. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. Async task loader is great for loading data in activities or fragments, but async task is more versatile for various background operations. It's not deprecated, and there are alternatives like RxJava and handler threads. And that's it, guys. We've gone through, found the solutions, and hopefully answered your query. If it did, please hit subscribe. I really appreciate it. And until next time, Hope you have a good one. Cheers.